Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We are so blessed to have so many people from so many places watching these YouTube videos and just continue, continue, continue to watch them, continue to subscribe, continue to like, continue to share because what we are doing is all for the glory of God. All oh, for the glory of God. That's all for the glory of God, Joe. I love that, I love that. Okay, so today's lesson is your identity in Christ. We have verses for your identity in Christ. And that's what we're going to talk about today because God really ain't in the Word. Yes, yes, we're going to be in the Word. And yes, we're going to talk about those. We're going to talk about the birds too. Yay! All right, so we're going to do our quick intro before we do your identity in Christ verses. All right, one, two, and three. Three, hit it. When you're feeling sad and you don't know what to do, trust in Jesus, he will see you through by your happy. Yeah. H-A-P-P-Y. Good. Ooh, I feel so good. Okay, Joe. Cartoons. We're gonna do cartoons, so let's get the word of God. The combination is five, twelve, five, five. I'm ready, brother Harry. I'm ready, ready. Hit the last one. Twelve, brother Harry. Twelve. Hey, look at our hand, brother Harry. Yes, look at you, brother Harry. It worked. Yes, it worked, Joe. You look good, Joe. You do, brother Harry. You do. We look good as cartoons. I always want to be a cartoon. Oh, my God. Yep, I always wanted to be a cartoon too, Joe. And so we get to be cartoons. Yeah! Okay, let's get to the Word of God. Let's see what the Word of God has to say. You know who would she would ask, Joe? You don't have to whisper, Joe. The Word of God, the Word of God. Yes, yes, yes. Do you see him around? Oh, he's over there, Brother Harry. There's a word. It's the word of God, Brother Harry. Hi, Joe. Hi, word of God. Hi, word of God. And hello to you, Brother Harry. Hello. The Bible, the word of God. You look so good. Thank you, Brother Harry. You look good, too. Can I give you a hug? Because you know God is all about love. Thank you, Word of God. Thank you. What do I mean? Can I get that? Of course, Joe. Ooh. I love the Word of God. And the Word of God loves you, Joe. All right. So let's look at the scriptures. I love how you guys are creative and how you are teaching people my word in the Old Testament and the combination. That is just really, really beautiful. I'm so proud of you that you're using your God-given talent, the talent that God gave you for his glory. All right, let's get to the word of God. That was pretty awesome. Yeah, that was. That was the word talking to it, Brother Harry. I know. It's good to it, Brother Harry. It's good. Let's get to the word. Okay. Okay. See, here it is, Galatians 2 and 20. I have been crucified with Christ. I no longer live, but Christ lives in me. The life I now live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and he gave himself for me. And me, and me too, Brother Harry. All right. Okay, and so this is our identity. We are inside of Christ. We no longer live for ourselves. We live for Jesus. Okay, yes we do. Okay, John 15 and 50. I no longer call you servants because a servant doesn't know what his master's business is. Instead, I have called you friends for everything I have learned from my father, I have made known to you. Amen. 
man, Brother Harry, that's right. That's Jesus talking. He is saying that we are friends. We are his friends. And the things that he is teaching us, it comes from his father. And his father is God, Brother Harry. Okay, Brother Harry, go ahead and continue to read. Now, I really love this one that is in, uh, in Matthew, the book of Matthew. And it talks about, Are not two sparrows sold for a penny? Yet not one of them will fall to the ground outside your father's care. And even the very hairs of your head are all numbered. So don't be afraid. You are worth more than many sparrows. This is so beautiful. Matthew 10, 29 through 31. It shows how important we are to God. So very important. And there's no need to worry because God is going to take care of us as he takes care of the sparrows, not one of them falls to the ground without him knowing it. And then there's another passage of scripture that we're going to read. Therefore, I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or drink, or about your body, what you will wear. Is not life more than food and the body more than clothes? Look at the birds of the air. They do not work or sow or reap or store away in barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not much more valuable than they? Can any one of you by worrying at a single hour to your life? No, we cannot. We cannot. Matthew 6, 25 and 26. So there's no need for us to worry about those things. God takes care of the birds. They don't have to work. They don't have to store things up. He takes care of them, Joe. That's just awesome. He loves us. Yes, he loves us. And that's why we teach his word to show his love. Let's do the song now. The song, guys. This is what we've been waiting for. Okay. Now it goes like this. Gen, 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 X, 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 La, 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 pity kiss. Num, 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 numbers. Do, 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 Deuteronomy. Do, 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 Deuteronomy. Then it goes, sing that twice. Here's what they mean, here's what they mean. Genesis, you say it loud. Genesis means beginning. Exodus means they're leaving. Leviticus, you look up to heaven because God's leading. Numbers, you're counting because God's counting, okay? And then Deuteronomy means repeat. So let's get some music and let's get to it. Let's have some fun, 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 play. <laughs> Send me videos and we'll feature you one of the other videos. <laughs> All right, God bless you.